Hello and welcome to Theme Park Worldwide where we're here at the Alton Towers Resort. And where are we staying tonight, Charlotte? We're actually staying at the Alton Towers Hotel. We are indeed. We got an absolutely fantastic deal tonight. We paid just £80 for a room yeah, tonight. Yeah, we did, which is really good. So we thought, you know what, we're going to stay over at the hotel, even though we're locals. We're coming to show you the full experience here. And uh, yeah, show you exactly what the Alton Towers Hotel experience is like. Now, are you excited? I love staying at Alton Towers. <laughs> it's funny, isn't it? Because we live so close. However, last year for my birthday, we did stay at the Enchanted Village, and it didn't was we? It was great. So we thought we'd never really filmed around the Alton Towers Hotel much on the channel. So we thought it'd be the perfect chance to stay over. Midweek price, worth pointing out as well. We are annual pass holders, meaning that you get access to the Merlin Holiday Club. Don't so you, you get a discount on your stay. So always keep yeah. that in mind. Definitely. But uh, along with that, we're actually going to be staying in a themed room. It's a Moon Voyager room tonight. I'm really excited for this. So you've got like the Moon Voyager rooms that are upstairs. You've got like the Arctic themed rooms here you've as got well. Quite a lot of themed rooms, to be honest. And also the standard explorer rooms that they've got here. Along with that in this hotel, they've got lots of different theme rooms like the Smiler that they do as well. Uh, they've got like the chocolate room that's sponsored by Cadbury's and so much more. So yeah, come and join us. We're going to show you around the hotel first, show you the lovely grounds and then of course, uh, yeah, make our way up to the room, give you a room tour and then later on show you some of the entertainment options and of course our breakfast at the Secret Ooh, Garden tomorrow. Nice buffet. Alton Towers, they always do a good breakfast, don't they? Really good breakfast. Come and join us here at the Alton Towers Resort as we stay over in a moon boy your room. Well, the Alton Towers Hotel opened here in 1996, and this was the first hotel to be built here at Alton Towers. Of course, now there's so much accommodation here. You've got Splash Landings next door that opened in 2003, the Enchanted Village, the CBeebies Land Hotel, and the Stargazing Pods. Yeah, there's so many different options. But yeah, this is the original hotel that I absolutely love. Uh, it'll always be a special kind of memory for me of this hotel, um, because it just looks so nice, and the theme of it, it's all based around Sir Algernon. It's such a classic, isn't it? It is. Sir Algernon his travels around the world. So there's like loads of little bits in here, like hidden gems. It's kind of like a museum in places. He's brought bits from around the world on his adventures. And of course, his magnificent flying ship is in the centre of the hotel. It's a really nice hotel. It is indeed. Nice but yeah, this was one of his original inventions, Sir Algernon. And uh, yeah, as you can see, it's a flying car. However, this car, the story goes, this car didn't actually make it all the way around the world. He needed to build something bigger. And that's what you can see there on top. Uh, with the big flying ship and that is the centerpiece to the hotel so yeah we'll go and take a look inside here we are then inside the lobby to the Alton Towers Hotel and yeah as you can see some great theming around in here which is very nice yeah it's kind of like all the different artifacts that Sir Algernon has kind of um, picked up on his travels over the years which is great you know, like the nice themed reception. Hello! <laughs> What's really cool is, just tell us about the check-in process on your phone and with these machines. I did the online check-in before we came and then it gave me a little text, sent me a text to let me know that my room was ready. Came and checked in on those machines and it was so quick and easy and the keys was done like within minutes. Yeah, it's, it's really, really cool. Process, yeah. yeah, it's nice because they, they never used to have these before like it's that. It's just so quick and easy. You can just go there, get your keys straight away. Yeah, definitely. But so uh, yeah, as we walk into the main parlor hotel, hello! <laughs> Yeah, you get to oh, <laughs> you get to appreciate all the wonderful decorations and theming in here. And of course, here's the magnificent flying ship that you can see, all based around Sir Algernon. And there he is, bringing the bell on the ship just there. But yeah, we thought it'd be the perfect time to kind of show you around. We just checked in. Checking time is three o'clock at the time of recording this video. And uh, yeah, checkout time is at 10 a.m. the next morning. But yeah, you've got some lovely decor and theming all the way around here which is great a little shop just over there as well but yeah things like the clocks that you've got around like this section over here all the clocks which is really cool really kind of chilled out vibes here in the hotel which is very nice and there you go so yeah you got like all this little area yes yeah, so this gets reserved at busy times for the treehouse guests of course that's some of the other accommodation that they've got so many clocks you always know the time in the Alton Towers exactly. Hotel <laughs> but yeah, we'll take you for a little look outside and of course we'll show you at night as well later on. You'll see the atmosphere completely changes. It's very chilled out in the daytime. At night, you have that kind of party vibe which around is, here. It's really nice, isn't it? Loads of entertainment on an evening as well. Yeah, loads going on, which is uh, great to see. And obviously, they've got a little board next to the reception that tells you all the uh, entertainment times. But yeah, it's just nice and chill. We thought it would be the perfect time to kind of show you for the video. Nice little tour around the Alton 
Towers Hotel just here. So yeah, we'll head downstairs and then we will head just out the back because it is gorgeous, especially on such a nice sunny day like today. Yeah, you really get to enjoy the magnificent flying ship. And of course there's the Dragon's Bar just over there as well. And a look into the Secret Garden restaurant. But we'll be taking you in there in the morning and we'll show you uh, our breakfast. Because oh. yeah, you love the breakfast. Honestly, I won't sleep tonight with excitement. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Alton Towers, they do a, uh, a good breakfast. Okay, let's look at the Dragon's Bar. Very nicely themed, some nice uh, decoration all around there as well. Very chilled out. Like I say, later on, you'll see it kind of, the atmosphere in it on a night. Really different. Yeah, it's really nice on an evening. It's just perfect for kind of walking around now and showing you the theming. The little mermaid here Hello. with the shells. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? <laughs> of course, the hotels are open throughout the winter as well and they do Christmas events here. You've got the fireplace down there that's really nice. And yeah, the huge traveling ship just here in the middle. Flying machine, this huge contraption crash landed right in the middle of the Alton Towers Hotel. But yeah, we're gonna head out these doors and we'll show you just out the back and then we'll of course head up to our room and show you that. But yeah, we'll be back inside the atrium in here later on as it's known. Beautiful. Here we are then, out in the back garden of the Alton Towers Hotel. And yeah, I think for me, I just love the design of the building. I think it looks really classy and all the planting around. And yeah, like I say, you've got various different themed rooms here um, on all the different levels. Then you've got the suites as well that are upstairs on the upper level. Some lovely water features out here as well. Now, prior to the CBeebies Land Hotel opening, um, I think this used to look better around here. The good thing is when they built CBeebies, it was done in the same style as the Alton Towers Hotel. However, uh, as you can see, they put all of the, uh, yeah, all the shutters on there, which to be honest, I think it would have been nicer without from this side. No, but I suppose because it's CBeebies, it's nice and colourful, isn't it? Yeah, it just doesn't fit with the, you know, the classiness of, 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 of this side. Seen all the colours. You know, I mean, CBeebies Hotel is beautiful and obviously you, to get to this, you don't actually come this way. It's got its own entrance around that side. Great in there for kids. However, I just think from this side, it would have been nicer without seeing yeah, the, um, the shutters on there. Maybe. You know, but uh, here we go, you got a stepping stone. After oh, you, Charlotte. Uh, <laughs> over the stepping stone. Yeah, this is nice. Oh, oh, oh. No, <laughs> Don't worry, I won't push you in. Yeah, it's nice here, of course, with the big fountain in the middle. Oh, the ducks have come to say hello. Hello. Hey, you wanted to be in the vlog? Oh, it wouldn't be a visit to Alton Towers without seeing the lovely ducks, would it? Hello. You coming in for a swim? You coming in? Come on, you coming in? He's in. Come on, come follow your friend. That's it. He's going for it, he's coming in. Stepping stones out here at the back. Yeah, here we go. This is my favorite view. Here he is, he's in. That's my favorite view of the hotel just here, especially when the sun is shining like today. So yeah, the hotel is actually based across three floors. And then on the top floor, which is then windows up there, that's the big suite. So rooms like the Smiler Room are not actually a suite here. Um, they're just like a, a, room, a very heavily themed room, but they're not huge like the suites on the top floor. And then, yeah, the rooms up there are massive. So much more than just a bedroom. I know so much about this hotel because I actually spent two years of my life working here. You're right there. <laughs> yeah, the ducks, that's what they do. Yeah, I spent like two years of my life working here. Before I knew Charlotte, that was. Yep. Um, but yeah, working here at the Alton Towers Hotel. So I do know a lot about it and all the rooms and where they are. And yeah, it's very nice. Love it out here. Because we're filming this when the theme park's still open this afternoon, it's so peaceful around here. You know, come the theme park closing, it gets a lot busier. However, this is a real nice place to come and sit, especially on an evening. Nice warm night, you can bring a beer around and chill out around here, looking out over the lake and the hotel. Now it's not all chilled out and relaxing here in the grounds of the Alton Towers Hotel. There's a play area just here as well. And then you've got Charlotte over there who's making the most of this uh, wonderful facility. Are you, are you all right there? Look at this relaxation. <laughs> it's nice, you've got a little seesaw over here as well, a little climbing frame. Yeah, just out the back here, which is uh, fun for the kids, or big kids like us too. Right, let's go and head back inside the hotel and we'll take you up to our Moon Voyager room on the third floor. It's so peaceful around here this afternoon. And yeah, we've made our way back inside now. And here's one of Sir Algernon's artifacts over here. Look at this huge 
<laughs> Charlotte's not the artifacts, there we go. But uh, Algernon's chair. chair, it is massive, isn't it? It's absolutely huge. Back in the day, they used to have a sign just up there before they put the fake bookcase in. They used to say, uh, big chair for naughty parents. Oh, that's funny. There you go, yeah, I think I've got a photo on there from uh, when I was a kid. But yeah, you've got like the little book over here as well. There is an arcade off to the left there, the toilets and the spa is also on the first floor just here. So yeah, if you head down that way, that takes you to the Alton Towers Spa, uh, which is very nice. I've only been in there with the once, but yeah, it's lovely. Of course, a big part of the hotel is the lifts, uh, because these are absolutely awesome. So the lifts are fully themed. That's so cool. And they play music, so I think we'll have a bit of a, a ride about in the lift for you, just so we can get a few different settings. There you go, look at the lifts. Sit back. Sit back, it's fright hour, it's our nemesis. We'll just take you for a couple of rides on the lift, just so, here we go. Get ready. Hey! Oh, Toyland Tours! Oh, I love it. Love the fourth floor. <laughs> In fact, whilst we're here, let me show you this. So yeah, I was saying about the sweets. Yeah, this is where the sweets are. You've got like the Coca-Cola room that's up here. Um, yeah, there you go. All the sweets head around. You get a great view here as well, looking at the top of the ship just there, which is quite nice to see. There you go, quite a fun little fact. But yeah, these are the suites just at the top up here. So yeah, you've got all the different ones. That's the Arabian Nights suite there. Yeah, yeah, 506 Arabian Nights. All the doors are, are nice down there. I can't remember what we got down here, Charlotte. They're always changing them, so. Let's have a look at the, uh, at the front of that. Oh, that used to be the big pajama suite. I don't know if it still is or not, but yeah. Oh, it's but so cool, isn't it? It is, a, a big part of the hotel, all the carpets. carpets. Yeah, we'll show you on our floor, um, it's all Moon Voyager themed. 10 out of 10 um, for the car. The carpets are great, and obviously you've got the bookcases that run around the side there as well. But yeah, these are much bigger. Because like I say, if you are booking like the Smiler Room, for example, it is a, still a, a smaller room, uh, but these are the full suites that they've got just up here. Yeah, absolutely massive things. Oh, there we go. Shows how quiet it is. Normally you wait quite a bit for the, uh, for the lift. Should we go back down to the ground, see if we can get a, there we go. Let's see what we can get. <laughs> Ooh, get ready. Oh. I love it. <laughs> the classic haunted house. Oh. There you go. I was hoping for Nemesis, but there you are. I'll have to go again. <laughs> well, yeah, you see where we're coming from. You've got all sorts of different ride. Uh, you know, I, I remember when I was a kid just going up and down, up and down. Oh, I can tank the canyon. If we don't get Nemesis the next time, then I'm giving up. That's it, here we go. We'll go back down to, uh, we'll go to, to three. So that's where we're staying, aren't we? There we go. Let's see if we can get, uh, let's see if we can get Nemesis. It might cut off because we're only going one floor. Here we go. Can it be Nami? We're going to get it? Hey! Da, 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 da. Nemesis. The Nemesis. The Nemesis. There we go. Lovely. So yes, welcome to third floor. So yeah, this is all Moon Voyage. The idea was you got kind of Arctic that's on um, floor two, um, and then yeah, you're kind of going up into space with the Moon Voyager room with oh, Sir Algernon's wow. travels. So yeah, these are don't date back to 1996 or anything. You know, these were only done a few years ago. So yeah, 302 is the Smiler room, just over there. The Cadbury room. Yeah, the uh, chocolate room there. Yeah, Cadbury back, of course, sponsoring that again. But how nice the carpet, Charlotte. Oh, the carpet's lovely. Yeah, beautiful, isn't it? And there you go, and there's a look down into the atrium. So you'll see all the entertainment. We're gonna get some footage of that later on and show you a little look at what the entertainment's like. And it does change seasonally as well, uh, the entertainment, of course. And there's a look down into the lobby. Yeah, and if you were uh, coming to stay at the Alton Towers Hotel and you like our room, we're staying literally just here in 345. We're staying at 345. Yeah. But yeah, here's a look at the themed corridor. Here we go. Let's go inside and take a look at the Moon Voyager room. Da, 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 da. The carpets, I love the carpets. Oh, the carpet's fantastic, isn't it? And the it? door's great, like themed on both sides there. Uh, and kind of like a vinyl on the door that looks really nice. Sometimes vinyls I'm not that keen on. But that looks really nice. Yeah, really I think so. Effective. Right, let's get started in the main bedroom then. Right, so we've got two nice bunk beds here, which is quite nice. Mmm, really well themed over there as well, which is cool. As you can see from all the wallpaper, round at the side there. Good 
also get an Xbox, which is quite cool. Yeah. Two controllers. Yeah, they're nice. So obviously, really good. back in the day, obviously when I used to work in this hotel, God, we're going back to 2009, but these rooms never used to have this partition of wall. So the bunk bed was still there, but the partition wasn't. So obviously now it gives the kids and the parents a little bit more privacy in here. Yeah, you've got the wall there, which is really nice. Yeah, a little divider. And if you've got a loud snorer as well, that's going to help, isn't it, with that one? Um, but yeah, of course, you've got like, the individual lights there as well that can be changed. And yeah, what's really cool is you've got this big piece of theming over here as well that's not a vinyl or anything. That's lovely. And yeah, we can actually turn them on. Ooh. So it's like a... Um, what do you call it now? I forgot now. Uh, when you like yeah, yeah, yeah. Like when you well, what's the name? I forgot what it's called now. Oh, it's going to annoy me. Um, but yeah, here we go. You've got the mirror just over Lovely there. Mirror. You've also got a hair dryer, which is quite nice. And then you can order um, food to your room as well. Yeah, so you can see a little look at the sample menu. There's not loads there, but you've got to think. You've got loads of food options. Secret Garden, Flandos next There's door. Quite a lot, isn't um, it? And the Enchanted Village, the Crooked Spoon, and yeah, of course, just if you want a light snack. the Roller Coaster Restaurant. Exactly. Which is where we're going to be heading to. So stay tuned for that vlog. It'll be coming up soon here on Theme Park Worldwide. We're also going to be going to Extraordinary Golf. But more about that in just a moment. But yeah, nice look at the mirror and the nice themed lighting. Just over here as well, you've got some nice lighting at the top, which is cool. And yeah, just like all the pipe work effect. Like all this is really uh, nice around here. Just like all the little dials. And of course, it kind of looks like it's powering the TV, which is really cool. Oh, oh isn't it lovely? What we got over here then, Charlotte? A huge teddy bear. A huge bear. And I like what they put on his uh, foot just here. If we have a look. Foot. You know, it basically says, stay here. Um, keep him here to continue enjoying the adventures with Sir Algernon. So it's actually themed into the hotel. How nice is that? Which is uh, lovely. It's nowhere for you to sleep tonight, Sean. Oh, no, you're joking. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's still staying in with us tonight. Look. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you got the huge oh, bed. No. Oh, have you just done that? Yeah, no. you're getting charged for that now. Oh, oh no. you need to sew it up. There you go. <laughs> oh, poor little bear. Oh, but yeah, you got the big bed um, just here. Which is really nice. Yeah, yeah, it's lovely. What else we got down here, Charlotte? Got some nice lights as well, which is nice. Nice vinyl again on the back. Yeah, again, I'm not normally too keen on the, the vinyls. However, in this hotel, it's done really nicely because you've got the actual theming on there as well, which is cool. Nice curtains. Curtains look good. The curtains are nice. Yeah, nice. this is where we're... Uh, let me show you out here. There we go. So yeah, we're actually, we started the vlog just out the front there. You've got like a little balcony off to the side here, the flags. Yeah, nice view. Obviously on the other side, you uh, look out to the lake as well, which is, uh, which is really nice. There we go. Yeah, you've got a nice themed phone down there as well. Oh, I can't believe him. Poor little guy. Oh, poor fella. Hopefully he'll get, to, he'll get stitched up soon. There we go. That's what he needs. Stitched up in a good way. I don't mean like someone's going to play a joke on him. So yeah, we said a strawberry golf's coming up. That's going to be the next vlog, right? Yes. This is the prize down here. Right, so this is Henrietta the Hen. <laughs> okay. So as she, she comes in a nice little chocolate basket with chocolate eggs and there's Henrietta on top. This is the prize for the winner. And she was three pounds from Lidl. Three pound 29 from Lidl. What a bargain. What a bargain, so that is the prize. Yeah, absolute bargain. So stay tuned, that'll be tomorrow's vlog. We're going to be playing <laughs> at Strawberry Golf, celebrating 15 years, Charlotte. Exactly, for Henrietta right here. There you go, proper little resort stay. Shall we uh, go through to the bathroom? Yes, follow me. To the bathroom. Again, just looking at the wallpaper up there and the purple. It's very Alton Towers, the purple. I love these rooms. I think they're very nice. Um, and the carpet really takes it. I'm not showing you this mirror here, actually, as well. Yeah, that's really cool. And all the themed lighting just up there. Right, what we got, Charlotte? So you've got a nice sink, which I think is of a nice size, to be honest. Nice mm. size sink. Lovely themed mirror again. Yeah, the, the theming is, is fantastic. I really like those. Got some nice... Um, body washes and a nice luxury sea kelp soap. There you go. Got the lights just up there as well. And again, all the pipes and stuff and wires are kind of, well, the wires are in the pipes, but it's all part of the theming, really which nice. is, uh, is, is really cool. Another nice feature on the wall there. Yeah, that looks awesome. And a lovely bathtub. There we go. And a shower. Yeah, the bathtub, pretty reasonably uh, good size that yeah, is. I think so. And again, you've got the theming on the back, which normally, like when you stay in themed hotels, the bathroom doesn't normally have much theming, to be honest. Well, it's really nice to see. To yeah, it's honest. good that they've got that. And of course, there's the, the toilet just down there yeah, as well. Look at the toilet, there's a little bin in there. You also yeah. get 
also if you are coming you do get like a baby crib that you can put your baby in yeah a little cot there and then you also get tea and coffee maker since it's got some nice biscuits here Sean. oh biscuits cappuccino shortbread salted caramel chocolate they won't last long no they'll be gone so yeah in terms of coat hangers obviously stuff to think about got a few not loads of coat hangers uh, up there, but there is quite a lot of storage. And there's also a fridge. Yeah, the fridge is great. I remember when the rooms never used to have fridges here, so that's really cool. But yeah, you got the fridge, storage at the bottom there. Um, in terms of plug socket, loads of plugs, yeah, and they've got USB. USBs. Which is quite good. Yeah, USB on there, and there's quite a few plugs. You got a couple there. Um, there's quite a few about, which is good. Yeah, plug sockets wise. Which is nice. Yeah, but that's our Moon Voyager room. I can't believe that. Like, literally, we had an absolute bargain. We paid. Um, literally, it was just over eighty pounds. Like eighty-two pounds. Eighty-two pounds, I think. Uh, it was. What an absolute bargain! And you know, obviously worth pointing out as well. You may get upgraded, uh, which is nice when you stay on the off-peak times, which is cool as well, it's isn't really it? Really cool. Yeah. There you go. Nice little. Uh, Little effects, but we'll see a little bit later on. We're off to uh, go and do a few other bits that will be coming up in the yeah. next vlogs. So we've got golf and roller coaster restaurant. I want to win Henrietta. That's the prize, so stay tuned for tomorrow's vlog for that. Um, but yeah, I just thought we'd show you our room, show you the hotel in the daytime, and then we'll be back later on, and we will show you it at night here at the Alton Towers Hotel. We'll see you a little bit later on. Well, it's been a few hours since we last spoken to you all. We've been to play golf, haven't we? We have. And also went to the roller coaster restaurant. Yes, yeah, so then vlogs will be coming up over the next couple of days as part of our stay here at the Alton Towers Resorts. Just thought I'd show you the water parks. Obviously, you can't film or take any photos here in the daytime when it's open. However, at night when there's nobody in, we can show you some shots just here. See, so yeah, I just threw the net in there looking at the Alton Towers water park. It would be great to be able to film a vlog in here one day. Um, but yeah, unfortunately, you can't do any filming or anything like that in the water park here. Quite a few places do allow it. Centre parks, you can. Um, you know, and other water parks out there in Europe, um, you can do. But yeah, here at Alton Towers, they don't allow it. Completely understandable, though, um, how they don't. But so uh, yeah, at the night time here, we're actually walking through now back to the Alton Hello. Towers Hotel. Yeah, of course, this is part of Splash Landings. And uh, yeah, maybe later in the year, we'll have a room in Splash Landings Hotel, because obviously that's all at the top there. And uh, we will show you that maybe at some point in the future. Yeah, that would be good to do. Yeah, we did Enchanted Village last year. We're doing Alton Towers Hotel tonight. So we thought, well, you know, we'll do Splash Landings at some point. I think for us, it's kind of the weaker of the hotels there. You know, Alton Towers Hotel and the Village are my favourites. Oh, I love the Village. It's really Yeah, nice. it's gorgeous. But yeah, just a little look just here at the Alton Towers Water Park. You can't see loads in here at night because obviously you've got the netting, but you've got like a lazy river down here, the Master Blaster. And yeah, this leads back through to Alton Towers Hotel. I'm going to be watching some of the entertainment shortly. And also I'm going to show you the uh, Arctic Corridor just down here. I love the carpet here. Like the carpets are fantastic in the hotels, but there you go. Walking over from Splash Landings, you can see we leave the beach behind. Say bye to the crab. And then you think, oh, we're in Alton Towers Hotel. But no, you've got this little crab down here. It's just escaped. <laughs> it's always the smaller details, isn't it? That I really like. Yeah, this is the conference centre just here on the right-hand side. And yeah, we're back here now in the Alton Towers Hotel. And yeah, the Arctic rooms that they've got here are just down here on the left-hand side. Yeah, we'll show you that corridor. Yeah, that's the gardens area out there where we was earlier on. CBB's Hotel. And yeah, this leads us down into the Arctic corridor. So yeah, obviously we're staying in a Moon Voyager room tonight, but these are the Arctic themed rooms. And yeah, you can see all the nice theming again in the corridor. It's lovely down here. It's great, yeah, all the snow and kind of like the footprints um, in the floor. And yeah, this is really cool down here with all the lighting and all the room numbers. Kind of similar style to the Moon Voyagers that are upstairs on level three. Um, but yeah, of course, a different theme, because obviously this is blue, turquoise kind of colors and brown, whereas Moon Voyager is kind of purple and a little bit darker. Um, but yeah, I just thought I'd show you the corridor because yeah, it's actually very nice and this leads you down into the reception. Oh, she's going without me. Hey, <laughs> going without me there, Charlotte. That's it, back into the magical lift. What are we going to get? Hey, Galactica. And that's it, all we get is the countdown. That's it. <laughs> Here's an awesome view then from the third floor looking down at the atrium of the Alton Towers Hotel. Yeah, really nice in here with all the lighting on there. It does look awesome, doesn't it, Charlotte? It looks lovely, doesn't it? Yeah, really nice. You got some moves for us tonight, have you or not? Oh no, here we go. Oh, that's really quite fast paced. That is still early evening at the moment. Here you go. <laughs> oh my God, she's going for it. Look at that. 
Oh wow, brilliant. Well, what have we got in terms of entertainment tonight then? What so we got? We've got some live singing, we've got a magic show, we've got a family game show. So we're going to go and get a seat down there. Yeah, let's go and check it have out. Have a drink and enjoy the entertainment here in the atrium of the Alton Towers Hotel. She's going for it. Show. <laughs> hey, hello. <laughs> okay, ready? Here we go. You touch the tail! Oh it's a long way. Here we go. Hey, Charlotte's go for a ghost. Hey! <laughs> hey, Charlotte's goat buzzer noise. <laughs> Do you have any like dramatic music at all? Something really tense? Something to fit the. Ooh. Oh. This is tense. Oh, We're playing for six free drinks from the bar, by the way. It's four down to two. Charlotte's in the final. Chloe, Charlotte, well done for getting yeah. through. Yeah. We're going to play the final round now. Now, audience, you cannot help during this round, even though you want to. I'm not banning you, it's just you literally cannot help because. We're gonna play rock, paper, scissors. Oh. Here we go, it's rock, paper, scissors. Six free drinks from the bar. Let's do the first person to three points is gonna win. So it's a nice chance. I am nothing but fair. Okay, so first person to three points is gonna win. So here we go. The first round. Let's do this. One, two, three, draw! Oh. Oh. oh! Did you hear the noise from over here? Oh! It's getting tense already. Let's try it again. One, two, three, draw! Oh! Oh! Woo! It's on this side. You want to try it? Charlotte's won the drinks! Hey! Here you go, Charlotte. Oh, what, what have you got there, then? What have you got? There you go, six free drinks vouchers, well done. Four down to just two, there we go. We got some fans as well who want some drinks. There you go, oh, there you go. Great game show, that was good fun, that was, wasn't it? Let's get some drinks, then we got some more singing. Well done, Charlotte. Rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> Nice Charlotte special this one. Things you do before. Always brings back their memories. There's the roller coaster restaurants. Oh. 
Well, you saw a little bit of footage there of the entertainment here at the Alton Towers Hotel. It's been quite nice because we met some fans of the channel in here oh, as well. It's been a funny night tonight. It's been brilliant. It has, yeah. So we gave them some of the drinks vouchers, yeah, exactly. didn't we? You won. Oh, well done, Charlotte. But uh, no, the entertainment had a good atmosphere. Really good tonight, yeah. For a quieter night, it was a great atmosphere, yeah, the wasn't atmosphere it? Was brilliant. Yeah, we have <laughs> had a good laugh That's tonight. Nice oh, but uh, anyway, coming up next in the vlog, the best bit for Charlotte. <laughs> The buffet <laughs> breakfast. Oh, the duck, even the ducks are excited. Look how happy they are. There you go. <laughs> but yeah, I just thought I'd show you out the front of the hotel, all lit up in purple. And obviously, our room is literally just over there. So, good night from Alton Towers Hotel. And we'll see you in the morning where we'll take you for breakfast at the Secret Garden Restaurant. Yes, let's go. The muffins are waiting. <laughs> Off Charlotte goes. <laughs> see you in the morning. Good night. Good morning from the Alton Towers Hotel, where it's another lovely sunny day. I said the time has come. What Charlotte's been looking forward to the most? <laughs> oh, what a great night last night. Good laugh, sat down here, enjoying the entertainment. Here we go, round to the secret garden restaurant now, just here. So, yeah, of course, they do evening meals in here as well, but yeah, this is where we're going for breakfast. Got the nice theme in just there. Oh, that's the breakfast. Here we go then, Charlotte. What have you got? So I've got <laughs> some nice mushrooms, a nice fried egg, some hash browns, and a slice of bacon. Well, there is also a few other things Sausage available. Sausages. Um, boiled eggs and then the whole toast. I haven't gone for my toast yet, but I will be having toast as well. Hey, you've got to get your money's worth. That's what it's all about, Charlotte. That's what it's all about. Here we go. Got the nice orange juice, which is like a classic, isn't it? Really, that you can get. Yeah, you probably get apple juice and stuff there as well. I'd imagine, yeah, like the standard kind of British breakfast, and also the Alton Towers muffins. However, they've got considerably smaller. These used to be huge, didn't they? The muffins. But yeah, the good thing is though, bring a bag and you can get plenty of them. If you're going on the theme park for the day, bring a bag. Get a few muffins, there you go. We have the theme in here in the Secret Garden is very nice. Of course, hence the name. It's like this uh, garden that's got all the trees and planting around, which is very nice. And yeah, that looks out towards the lake just over there as well, which is really cool. All the clouds, the birds painted in the ceiling. It's just got a nice ambience. And yeah, that looks out towards the lakes. Yeah, right, I'm gonna go and uh, get my breakfast now. Lovely, yeah, they've got cereal collections as well. So yeah, I'll go and, uh, go and show you that. Is it good? Oh. So you've got quite a wide selection of cereals available here in the Secret Garden restaurant as well. I've just gone for some uh, Rice Krispies just there. I don't normally have a cooked breakfast. I don't normally eat too much in the morning. This is plate one of my cooked breakfast. Plate one? How many plates will it involve? I'm at least two. Well, just over your shoulder there, I can see some uh, little mini pancakes oh, that they've got as well. Right <laughs> Why not make the most of it? But no, it's very nice in here. I do like the theming. Oh, here she is then. Oh, I'm stuffed, I am. Did you enjoy your breakfast? I ended up with three plates. Three plates and plenty of muffins as well. And plenty of muffins. Plenty of muffins, which is good. But yeah, like I say, it's always good to take a bag. You can take something to the theme oh, park yeah, for the day. Exactly, that's well, you've paid for it, haven't you? Exactly, you've paid for it. But I think the breakfast is pretty good. Breakfast is nice, I really like it. Yeah, there's always uh, a lot on offer, so which is nice. Oh. But yeah, back in the room now, just before we check out, like I say, standard checkout time. 10 o'clock, oh, there's the hen just there. The hen's there. Yeah, we had some of the basket last night, didn't we? <laughs> but uh, yeah, something that I did forget to mention when we did the room tour earlier in the vlog uh, was the fact that you've got the air conditioning unit. Now, back in the day, the rooms here at the hotel used to get baking hot and there was no air conditioning at all. But obviously now, you've got this, yeah, of course, nice air conditioning unit. It also acts as a heater if you want to as well, which is quite which cool. Really good, yeah. Yeah, which is available. Um, in the room, but yeah, we're just gonna go and uh, get checked out, aren't we now? We are. Yeah, and then, uh, yeah, we'll uh, get outside and wrap up our vlog from our nice stay here in the Moon Voyager room at the Alton Towers Hotel. And there's the bear, that's where he slept last night. Hope you get your arm fixed soon, pal. <laughs> is it his arm or is it his leg? It's his leg. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, I hope it gets fixed soon, mate. There you go. 
Well, there we go. That brings us to the end of our stay here at the Alton Towers Resort. Oh, it seems weird, doesn't it, saying a stay? Remember, they're it so does, close. It does, doesn't it? Yeah, you can't pass up £80 for a room. And like I say, if you are a Merlin annual pass holder, head on to the Merlin Holiday Club website. You get your discount. Yeah, and it's kind of automatically gives you some special rates on there, doesn't Which it? Which is always worth checking out. Yeah, it's the same for the parks down south, obviously, when we stayed over last year at the Shark Cabins, uh, along with that as well at the Chessington Hotels. Uh, so it's always worth looking out for getting the uh, the good prices because to be honest for what you get for 80 pounds it's fantastic it was a bargain really yeah sometimes some of the places we've been to on our theme park travels we've paid that for a travel lodge exactly yeah and even more than that i think for a travel lodge so it's nice you know we've got to look out obviously friday nights and on the weekends it is much more hence why they do get the reputation of being very expensive very hotels. very expensive um, but literally you know of course in the moon voyager room as well that was really nice and uh, yeah i'm sure we'll stay in the future maybe do splash landings next yeah i think we should do splash next yeah because we haven't stayed there and filmed it before stay at splash landings and uh, show you the rooms there of course a caribbean themed hotel but so uh, yeah we filmed a couple of other vlogs during this stay coming up tomorrow will be extraordinary golf Ooh. so find out who uh, wins the chicken uh, and then of course we go to the roller coaster restaurant as well that'll be coming up checking out the new menu in there and of course any other updates inside the uk's only roller coaster restaurant but so uh, there we go thanks for joining us Thank at the you. alton towers hotel we're going to go out and enjoy the lovely sunshine and that leaves us with one final thing to say. Get, Get out, out there and keep, keep on, on riding. riding. See you in tomorrow's vlog.